What has your experience been like on the show? Um, it's been great. Um, I've came onto the show. I've done basically everything. I rapped, I danced, I sung, and um, I feel like tonight I really just proved myself as a singer and a total artist, whole package tonight. And you do seem to be like doing it all. Did you get confused when Adam said you were a great sing uh, rapper and Christina said you were a great singer? Um, no, no, not confused at all because um, if you look back at my battle round, um, Adam was really feeling more of the rapping, not the singing. And then when I did the live shows and heard the singing, then he wanted the singing versus the rapping. <laughs> so I think they were kind of confused, but me, I was good. I mean, I know I go off by emotions and how a song hits me. And, um, you know, when I went up there and I sung it and I rapped it, I just love to do everything. Any way that a song can touch me, I go for it. How has your life changed since you've been on The Voice? I mean, a lot of fans, a lot of exposure. Um, me coming here and just breaking the barriers and doing something new. And I feel like my my presence will always be felt on this show because I'm paving the way for everybody else like myself to come here and do something like I'm doing. And which did you think was more emotionally draining, the audition rounds or the battle round? Um, maybe the, I would say the audition rounds because you don't, you know, once you get to the blind auditions, you don't know if you're going to be picked. And uh, especially for my, coming from my point stand, I, I was coming on rapping and all the chairs are turned around and they're like, what the heck is this guy doing? He's like rapping and I'm expecting, no, nah. you know, like I'm like, and I came out there and I just did it and Christina turned around and I couldn't be more happy with the coach that I have. She's always been pushing me out of my comfort zone really pushing me to just make it, you know, and um, I've, I'm taking a lot away from the show. What's the best advice Christina has given you? Um, I would say the best advice that she gave me was to really just um, be myself, own it, and uh, just be a true artist, man. You can come up to a show like this and you can be a true artist. You don't have to hold back. You don't have to come here and compromise yourself. And um, I feel like throughout this whole competition, I haven't compromised myself. I really gave the crowd and gave the audience me. And people can expect what my album would sound like and my tour would be like when they come out and see Moses Stone. So. If you could collaborate with any artist, who would it be? Christina Aguilera. <laughs> it would be my coach. I would love to work with her.